Counter-Strike Global Offensive is an intensely competitive FPS game, adored by millions of people from all around the world. Many players would say that the main goal of this game is to either defend one of two bomb sites as a counter-terrorist or try to detonate a bomb on one of the two sites as a terrorist. But I recently discovered that this is not actually the case. What most people don't know is that when the game's developers Ho Chi Minh and Pedophile were creating Counter-Strike, they originally intended for the terrorists to be the ones defending an area, while the counter-terrorists try to regain control. But due to a glitch in the code, these roles were swapped. Later, when they realized what they had done, they had already become too busy birthing the Democratic Republic of Vietnam or going to jail to be able to patch the bug. So, I bring you Counter-Strat Global Defensive, Counter-Strike as it was meant to be played. You may recognize this map. It's been an active duty map for many, many years. Very often, you'll hear people complaining about this map. Some will say that it's extremely unbalanced. Others will say it's way too confusing. Well, there is a valid reason for people having these problems. They've been playing this map entirely wrong. On the map overlay, there are two graphical glitches that appear. Two large letters, an A and a B. People have come to interpret these symbols as being indicators for bomb sites. In reality, however, these two spots have absolutely no significance. The one and only important spot on the map is this area, known colloquially as Z, or connector, or Z, if you are mentally handicapped. The real lore behind this map is that the terrorists must run to this ticket booth, retrieve their wrongfully revoked passports, and defend the booth from anyone who tries to get in their way. And today, I'll show you how to do this. The best way to gain connector control on the T side is by blocking off all of the gaps around your path that the CTs might be hiding in. If you are coming out of TCON, this means that it is imperative that you smoke off Sandwich, Red Train, and Pop Dog. This will give you a direct route to connector without having to worry about as many angles. Getting used to connector control from TCON is fairly easy to pick up. This is because the glitched A symbol on the map is really close to the objective, meaning that you can apply any AX key you would like and be able to get the connector quickly from where you would usually end up. It is very important that you do not plant the bomb on the train, because once your team enters connector, they will not be leaving for the remainder of the round. Getting the con from Brown Hall is also extremely easy. By smoking the gaps between ramp and white train, white train and red train, and CT entrance, you will have a straight path all the way to the objective. Again, it is important that nobody takes a detour to the middle train to plant the bomb, because there is no way for your team to be able to defend it after the bomb is planted, because everyone will be sealed off in connector. Once your team has successfully taken connector control, your goal now is to stop anybody from entering. You can do this by using your remaining smokes and molotovs to close off both ends of the corridor, and by hiding in corners that are out of sight from both entrances. You can now pick off anybody that dares to push into connector in order to rotate to the opposite site. When the CTs on A call an A rush, all of the CTs on B will rush the connector to rotate and try and regain control. They will then be met by a barrage of bullets from the T's, whose biannual trip to Saudi Arabia had been cancelled by the racist counter-terrorists. Then, after the B players scream that the T's are actually taking to B, the CTs on A will have to rotate through connector as well to try and regain control of the other site, meeting the same fate as their allies. Once you feel you have a safe exit back at spawn, you can all return to your start point, planting the bomb on the way if you would like. 